Hello, I am Mal. I'm back here with my buddy Sabouts for some more Bromance Cute Force here in Stellaris. So, Sabouts, what are we thinking about the Unbidden? The Unbidden? Well, I'm thinking the Unbidden's about to, uh, about to get wiped out of the galaxy here. They're, they're suffering. They're suffering hard. Yeah, they're not looking so good over there. Um, now, we were talking a little bit before we started recording that, um, had some good suggestions in the comments I actually went and did some more reading about like what's the best way to deal with them and because they are so shield heavy um i guess we could have gone for projectile weapons uh because of the inherent you know shield piercing ability uh, which would have helped because i guess even though this hasn't happened for us yet but i guess if you have the exact right counter um counter weapon to an enemy then the whole military power thing doesn't matter as much as it used to. Remember how it used to be only about military power, but apparently that's not yep. really a thing anymore. So that's pretty awesome that they did uh, do away with that whole military power thing. And now you can actually, I mean, I'm watching right now pretty much, you know, I just watched the 75K Unbidden Fleet get e eaten up by about 50K. So it's not, you know, it's pretty, it's not always about how many ships you have anymore or right. how powerful they are. If you've got counters to what they're using for defense, what they're using for attack. I mean, it makes a pretty big difference. It's like if you run into a fleet with missiles, but you've got a ton of point defense, you know, that right. fleet's not going to do too hot against you. Which is cool. Well, I mean, is... we wanted the combat to be more complicated and, and it is more complicated in 1.3. Plus, you can't just do Tachyon lances on destroyers and have that be the end. <laughs> which exactly. Is, which is what you do before. You'll be like, yeah, there we go. We're set. Yeah, which is what I'm trying to do now still, but yeah, it's definitely not as effective. It's still pretty good, but not as effective at all. Not as good, right? Yeah. Oh, it was pretty much like you get tacky on Lance. That was it. It was like end game for anybody around you if they didn't have it any or any type of counter to it. I'm bidding here actually trying to push back out. Are they? But they're not. They're just, I see they've got, now they've got fleets. Um... Yeah, I that see. That are pushing back out a little bit, and then construction ships. So they're trying, trying to get back out there and rebuild, but they're not going to do it. I'm not in any position to go after. You know, I'm not in any position to like go to war right now. I mean, my fleet is like still pretty screwed up. Yeah, I have a 11k fleet right now that I'm just kind of flying around cleaning up these construction ships, but I'm in no ability to take them on in their main system i'm falling the inari fleets around it or not the inari the uh, uh the uh, linus redacticus or confederacy's fleets somebody laughed in the comments because i always pause when i go to say that i have to like read the name like three times well, in my it's, head before I it's <laughs> yeah it's 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 not the easiest of names to pronounce people so it's, it's funny because yeah. Every single time I go to read it, I have to like stop and think about it and I have to read it like three times to make sure I say it correctly. It's a tricky name. It's tricky. Yeah. Get a, give right. us, give us, you know, give us a little slack, people. Give us a little slack. Look at that. And even the Inari here kind of pushing out in some areas, which is interesting, especially because they've been pretty weak uh, since the Unbidden came in. They've been fairly weak almost the whole game. Uh, the Inari just really put them in their place, but it looks like they are running from the Inari's or the Unbidden 71k fleet right now. Oh my goodness. Curator Lombada Enclave destroyed. Deep Space Communication Arrays picked up a brief automated distress from Curator Lombada Enclave and the Tornad system. Their submission ceased just after a few minutes. The long range recon probes have confirmed that the ancient Curator station has been destroyed. What? The forces responsible for the attack remain unidentified. Oh Wait, the, my goodness. No. The, oh my goodness. No. How could this happen? No, not our buddies. Oh, that's that really actually sucks. Oh, man. That's a technical oh. term. If people didn't know that term, that it sucks. <laughs> oh, <laughs> jeez. I can I can't believe that happened. I, I'm I'm really that, upset. Does that mean I that there's something else now creeping around? I don't know. I'm kind of that's what I'm wondering. What I mean, what's that mean? I guess maybe it's just a random event that can happen. But uh, what a disappointment, nonetheless. Well, the trade guys are still alive. That's the important part. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Trade but. 
Boy, that's really upsetting. Oh, wait, there's something there. Oh, okay, hold on, hold on. Let me, uh, let me pick my new research. Let's take a look at this, then. I guess I'll get, uh, I guess I'll unlock... It was destroyed, and then something appeared there. I'm a little freaked out. Did it come up... Uh, it didn't come up in the situation log, though, right? No, but there's something there. Where Where is this something that you're referring to? Where is the Trond system? Uh, it's right in my system, and it's... <laughs> I'm a little freaked out. Where? It's I'm in your territory? Yeah, it's right next near my planet there. Hold on, I'm doing battle right now with the Unbidden, so... I can't go over there. Let me, let me get, wait, I can jump over real quick. It's in the, uh, number 19, right next to my, right next to, right where my, uh... Oh, I see. Independent is, yeah. Uh, okay, let's investigate. Oh boy, I'm taking a bulk of the beating here from the unbidden on, during this battle. It's not, I mean, it says investigate, but... I saw that, but it won't, I had the same thing, it wouldn't let me. Yeah, it won't let you. Oh, I wonder what that is. We should probably find out. You know what? Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to send a construction ship that I don't care about at all. Oh, I took quite the beating there. Jump it in over there. Wow, Inari and... Uh, Felinus Redacticus Confederacy fleets combining right here. I guess I'm going to go ahead and join them. We're I at... think we're about to hit the portal. Oh, I see. I see. Because uh, there is a lot of us and they're all moving in one direction. And really, that's the only, that's the last place left. So either they're going to hit the portal or they're just going to pretend that the portal doesn't exist. Uh, we're about to find out what they decide to do. Yeah, is that thing still in my system? I, I can't really look right now. I don't know. I'm jumping a ship over there right now just to see what it is. Or try I'm to little, see what it is. I'm a little freaked out by it. They are jumping. Where is the question? Looks like away. Okay, it's... I I don't know what it is, man. Yeah, it's odd that it, it just flew into that system, destroyed the it's... curators there, and then left. And it's just odd, actually. Like, the planets Wide. that are here and stuff, they're, like, blown apart and stuff. So, I, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Wait, it's, got, the... it's, got a, it's got a skull on it, though. I can tell you that. Oh boy. So that's 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 not good. No, that's not good at all. Are they jumping into the Lastus or not? Uh, it doesn't look like it, no. It doesn't look like they're going to. Or at least they're not yet. They're, they're fighting, fighting right now. They're though. fighting in a cur. Yep, I see that. Uh, the Unbidden still spawning in fleets. I mean, I can't take them on by myself. I was hoping the AI was going to help, but it doesn't look like they are. Yeah, they're fighting them here in a cur. Why don't you help them? I've got, I'm on yeah. route, by the way. Oh, are you? Okay. Yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm jumping in now. I got my little 8K mil <laughs> fleet because I haven't been able to build it up. I keep taking beatings every time I just start getting it built up. I usually lose 2 or 3K, but that's all right. I want to keep in the system here, helping out the Inari and whatnot. I imagine any time now somebody's going to make a push in that system. It's just somebody's got to do it. They're about to get smashed because they're going to lose their shield. As soon as their shields go down, they're like very glass cannon-y, the, the unbidden. I see that, yeah. Yeah, it's like, boom, shields down, and then they just start falling apart. Yeah, as soon as you take their shields down, it's like, it's hilarious because it's all of a sudden they start dropping in like 10k power. Yeah, so definitely that suggestion about either using strike aircraft or using, or spacecraft, you know what I'm saying, people. Don't look there they go. Like, don't look at me like that. <laughs> um, <laughs> Dropped. Yeah. They just get toasted, right? So it looks like they might be heading towards Lastus, the last bastion of hope for the Unbidden. And their fleets are heading in that direction. I'll be hanging outside the system. So if they do jump in, if they decide they want to do something about it, 
That thing is still hanging out. Can't believe it just came in here. You think talking about that thing in your backyard? Yeah, I might. It's not doing anything right now at the moment. It's though. not. No, so... I see that. The only thing it's doing right now is making me super uncomfortable. <laughs> what I'll what I'll do is I'll send one destroyer to like hang out on the edge of that system. Yeah, I'll be sending my fleet back there to deal with that eventually once I figure out. Okay, I'm yeah, in. Okay, a, I see I'm in a occur with you. Yep, I see you coming in. It looks like they're not gonna jump into Lassus, so I don't know what their dude their plan is. We've captured some alien vessels in the Mal Prime system. These strange objects. Oh, okay. Okay, I got that too. So it looks like we both got it. Okay. After successfully translating their language, we have established communication with the Manath Empire. Okay. Oh, who are we letting in the Federation Association? There are Mathy Cancers to invite the Methine Empire Association. Okay, sure. Uh, yeah, yes, we vote yes. Okay, so, so this is a despotic empire. Harmonic imperialists. The Methine Empire. Oh, interesting. The Felinus Redacticus Confederacy made a protectorate of them as soon as we made, gave them association status. I wonder if that was a slight against us. No, no. They just We're made doing those... that. We're talking to those guys? No, they just made them a protector. I don't think it has anything really to do with us. Does it make them lose association status, though? Uh, yes, I think so. It doesn't really matter, though. We don't care. They weren't a Federation member. They were just going to be associated, right? So Yeah, I think so. It doesn't make a big difference to us, I don't think. I'm Ben still trying to push it out. They've got the path into their portal system they are guarded. Well, I'm kicking it in this in the Tron system. I'm sitting there just sort of watching this thing with a destroyer. If I set my fleet up to go heal, where are they gonna go? All the way to the floor. Yeah. I'm gonna send my fleet up to go heal. You heard me, right? No, where are you? Yeah, you're in. You're right outside the. I've got one. I've got one ship just set, sort of monitoring that. Oh, that yeah. Did uh, we investigate and figure out who they are? No idea. We don't have the option. That's so. That's odd. Right. You know what? Where's that other curator? That maybe we could talk to them and figure out what's going on. Uh, there's. There isn't one to talk to anymore. The one that got destroyed was the one that could give out information. I thought there was one more that could do that that we found. Uh, there's the artist enclave and the trade enclave. They don't give out. I mean, I'll talk to the artist oh, guys. Wait, no, I think I found right here. There's another curator where they're in the. The path vortex. Number 14. Yeah, when you say number 14, that doesn't help me. <laughs> Where's it at? Oh, they don't have anything, though. It's in, um... Down by the Serene Foxtail Commonality, but it's actually in the... What is it? Who are these people? The Zrekorpor Serene Foundations? Re I can't pronounce that. It's in the... Zrekorpor Serene Foundation? Yeah. Wish there was a way to ping. Right? Oh, I guess... Yeah, that would be an interesting. Like, if you could zoom out and then I could ping something and you could zoom in on it. Yeah, that would be awesome. Or if you could just, like, hyperlink it and I'd be like, oh, it's there. Yeah, that would be a good feature, actually. Yeah, so if you go down by, like, the Serene Foxtail Commonality. Yeah. yeah. And then you got the the Zrakpor Serene Foundation. Their little blob to the farthest to the right, right off of the Felinus Redacticus. If you zoom in on that, there's a vortex in there called the Pathibon Vortex. Okay.
There's actually a search function too. Oh, do tell. Um, yeah, down on the bottom right corner, there's actually a. It's hotkey F. Hotkey F. You type in the path. What's path. If if you put P A T, it'll come up the path of bottom vortex. P A T. Aha. But I already uh, tried to talk to him, and they didn't have any information to give. So you would think that they would say something about the fact that another curator was destroyed, but maybe not. Well, I'm going to build some more ships, because why not? Oh, I'm going to speed it up to you. Fast. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. I forgot that we were going slow. But... Another destroyer. I need a admiral, but I didn't have space. I didn't have space in my leaders. Still don't. I got a scientist from the curators. I don't know if he's going to leave once his time's up or now that he has nowhere to go. Is he going to stay? Because that would be awesome. I don't want to jump into there or fight fighting somebody I can't fight. I don't know why they're not moving the lastest though. I don't either. I don't get it. I don't know why. There's I, enough. There's enough firepower here to go. That's what. Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Were I mean, they just gonna sit around and just let it keep spawning fleets? I mean, that doesn't make any sense to me. Nari just lost a 5k fleet because they're not paying attention. I guess you and me can wait until we've got the Federation fleet. I think all three of us together, mm -hmm. me, you, and the Federation fleet could take on Lassus. And hopefully if we jump in there, um, the other people around us will jump in with us. But it's kind of hard to say. The Floor Foundation is going to be the president next. Oh, this isn't so. good. What's that? So the one of the awakens that I refuse to, you know, become like part of their deal. They're like negative one sixty to me. That's that's not good. That's no, not that's good. not good at all. That's bad times right there, buddy. Bad times. Oh crap! What? They're also in a federation with the other. Uh huh. Awaken Empire. What? <laughs> <And> what? <laughs> In what yeah. kind of world is that even okay? Yeah, That's like not why even is that okay, fair? Why is that's that not fair? even an okay thing? Why should both two fallen empires in the game and they're they're in the same federation? I don't understand why that's even a thing right now. <laughs> oh, if they want, they could literally declare war on anybody and just take them out. There's not even a contest. Well, I just talked to that new curator. Oh, I don't even know if I want to do this anymore. Oh, boy. I'm starting to think it's going to have to be us taking on the unbidden by ourselves. Yeah, it kind of seems like that. And man, some of this stuff, like, I don't understand. Like the Phineas, Redacus, Confederacy, like some of their systems, like this one in, a, like, occur. It's like, why don't they, why haven't they built the things to harvest all these resources? Like, ridiculous amount of resources, and they're not, they're, like, most of their systems, actually, they don't even have any stations built. This is stupid. Oh, it's that might be, although I do see some areas that don't have stations in their main part, but I think that that uh, upper area there is all the area that they reconquered back by, uh, by from the unbidden. Yeah, but they should have rebuilt it by now. I would 
You would think so, yeah. I'm looking around to see. They do have a construction ship flying around. Or at least it's sitting dormant in this system. It doesn't look... It doesn't appear to be flying around, but there is a construction ship up in the area. Huh. How interesting. Well, I'm very rapidly getting advanced strike craft, so... Good, that's good. We're gonna need them. I'm working on it uh, with technology. I'm working on increasing their attack speed and strength and whatnot. Kind of doing a quick scan right now across the galaxy. I'm just looking to see if there's anybody that's... Is somebody else we could recruit, you mean? Yeah, for the Federation, because... Would appear we're going to need it. Yeah, we're gonna need more, but I can't. I find it odd. There's nobody. I'm actually jumping my fleet back, because since we're not fighting right this moment, I want to go back so I can do upgrades. That's a good idea. There's no reason for us. To yeah, be up there. it's gonna be. A, it's gonna be a little bit. Because I'm gonna build some carriers and I'm gonna switch some stuff over, and so I figure I might as well just go back. And then I'm going to have some new colonies starting up here, hopefully soon. Because I've got that, um, believe it or not, I think, the system that I was training, yeah, the system I was training into, uh, that world into a Gaia world, it's got 2,500 days left. So it's... Oh, nice. It's going to happen. Gaia world's going to happen. on the way. It's amazing. It <laughs> Matter disintegrator. That seems pretty powerful. Actually, seems more powerful. Yeah, it's more powerful than my energy weapons now, isn't it? Oh, it is. Okay. Perfect. So my fleet actually needs to be upgraded now too. Ship and some more corvettes. Yeah, I just don't want to lose like my whole, you know, do the whole lose my whole fleet thing again. I just want to be prepared this next go. Yep, I agree. I'm gonna send my fleet off to get repaired or to get uh, upgraded right now. Um, especially because I got a lot more minerals coming in now. Perfect. So getting my fleet built back up. I want my fleet to be pretty much at full capacity when the time comes. Actually, I don't. I don't want them to be pretty much at full capacity. I want them to be at full capacity. Federation fleet is at 57,000. Wow. Mm -hmm. The floor foundation will be the next president. After them, I imagine it hasn't been us for a while, so I feel like it's going to be one of us. Should be you. I Yeah, it might be.
but it doesn't go in order of the list. Like if somebody's looking at it and going, well, it just goes in order of the list. No, actually, it doesn't, people. It does not, no. It does not. So the Star Foxes have 240 ships. Oh, wow, that's a lot, man. 240. Mm hmm. They have 240. I mean, we don't know what types of ships, but they have 240 ships. They have by far the most. I'm second at 124. Wow. I'm at 120. No, that's my naval capacity. You have 31 ships. Oh. <laughs> Oh, Sildor and okay, hold on. Declared hold on. War Let's the... pause this. What happened here? Oh no. The Sildor and Forces just declared war on uh, our Federation. Okay. Well, on the Floor Foundation, who is in our Federation. Um. All right. Well, set your battle. Set your goals. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, what do I want? the Sildur Enforcers to do? Well, I guess I want them to need some planets. <laughs> mm hmm I'm gonna grab Humiliate. And then I guess we'll liberate some stuff. Who's near us? Who would be good to liberate? Um... Something near us? That's a good... Point. They had humans there. You could liberate Earth. Soul yeah. two. Yeah, I saw that. All right. Well, let me let me do that then. Soul two. This will be interesting. It's gonna be very interesting to see what happens here. I gotta wonder if the Sildur Enforcer's whole- Oh, is there only whole? main defender can set demands, so we can't even set any demands. Oh, okay, okay. so we well, can just suggest them, I guess? I guess we can suggest, yeah. But we're also fighting the Zircon Mediators, by the way. Right, yeah, I, I saw that. Um, what is- well, I guess we'll find out. Uh, we are at 28 minutes, though, so... Alright, well, we'll get into this, which could be quite ugly, actually. Depending on who these Zarkon mediators decide to come get, which my guess will be me. I would assume, yeah. <sighs> so here's the deal. If the AI doesn't come over and actually help, then it's not going to be good times for us. No. Oh, but my, my fleet's in the area, and I know yours is too. Yeah, it is. Um, um, I wish we had the Federation fleet in our control. Me too. All right, folks. Well, we'll find out what happens in the next one. So we hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, consider hitting that thumbs up. Till next time, he's about. I'm Mal, and we'll see you later.